It's a process called life. And Governor Arnold Schwarzenegger claims it could be the clean solution to this country's massive energy needs. This fusion energy that we're talking about here, which creates no greenhouse gases whatsoever, but provides so much energy. So I cannot wait for this to become a reality here. LIFE stands for Laser Inertial Confinement Fusion Fission Energy. It uses the 192 lasers inside the nearly completed National Ignition Facility at the Lawrence Livermore National Laboratory. As shown in this lab animation, when bombarded with lasers, a ball of frozen hydrogen gas as small as a pencil eraser would ignite and release incredible amounts of clean burning energy. A thousand times more power than, you know, lighting up the whole United States. It's the same type of energy emitted from the sun and stars in our solar system. Once this facility is completed in March of next year, scientists here at the lab are hopeful that they'll achieve fusion ignition within 18 months. That is, if it works. So far, no experiments have actually been performed here yet. The facility's completion is about six years late and more than a billion dollars over budget, now topping $3.5 billion. Still, lab director George Miller is confident this work will succeed. I think we will get ignition. I think we will get ignition uh, relatively shortly after we turn the facility on. But, uh, uh, you know, it is, uh, it is science, it is technology. It's not done till it's done. If the process works, scientists hope to build a life pilot power plan around 2020 with commercial deployment by the year 2030. In Livermore, Laura Anthony, ABC7 News.